<sighs> is Spider-Man New Game Plus good? Uh, and the simple answer, yeah, I don't know. It's, 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 it's good. It's good. Let's, but I don't know. That answer obviously sounds unsure, but this is the more so my uh, first impressions of it because I have not completed the New Game Plus, unfortunately, but I wanted to make this video to share that it's adding more to the game like we thought it would. Uh, good in the sense that, yeah, it did exactly what we asked it to do. Add new suits, a little bit more splash to life, uh, gonna fix some things in the game that I'm gonna get into now, but it still fell short to a lot of us and I'm gonna get into why. First of all, they've added a lot of new changes when it comes to this game. Um, they've added more than what we thought they would and things that I guess that, you know, we kind of should already had. Um, so just to get into just like the extra tidbits of what they did add, they did have some new suit changes like the Raimi suit, which is very, very nice. Very, very, very nice change. They also changed the classic Spider-Man suit. A lot of people didn't notice this one, but they did change the suit up and it, um, actually did. Uh, they changed like the webbing or something on the suit or something like that. They also changed the ox suit. It had this little dot on it and uh, they changed that up and I guess made it, you know, not there anymore. Uh, just like, like I said, stuff that they went on the radar and just kind of fixed uh, that they kind of needed to fix. They fix. And it was really good. I, like I said, the Raimi suit, the people are excited about that. The Amazing Spider-Man suit kind of has a bug to it, but it's it's pretty, pretty good. Um, Not too bad with some of those changes. Could have done a lot better. But in terms of like the new game plus, you do get new ultimate levels. We can get into that. You get new ultimate levels with new Venom suits, which I haven't unlocked all of them yet, but I've seen all of them and they look sick, man. They look great, but I locked a few of them and it did. It is a grind, y'all. It is a grind to get these ultimate levels. Make sure you are uh, doing those tricks in the air and stuff like that to kind of farm your way to the missions. But so far, what I did and my method is I've done all the Sandman missions, every single side mission that you see just do it clear the map before you even get to the next uh story mission the reason why that is is like it's easier to do it now because like when we did it before it was hard to get to those story missions because it was you know you didn't have the transversals you didn't have enough to fight but now that you have all that stuff it's easier to do these side missions quicker and you can just go to do the story missions and just coast through that that's just what i've been actually doing so that's been leveling me up i barely got through the first half of the story and i've already got two ultimate levels so with that being said when we get into more so like how this new game plus actually affected the game in general um again like i said out of what we needed the two new suits are okay half and half for me i like the peter suit don't really like the mouse suit that much it's growing on me but i don't really I'm not too fond of it uh we got the two ones that you can buy but it's a uh, again hit and miss and yeah like the replay missions the weather changing all this stuff is great but i don't know it felt like it could have been more this was an update that should have been done at launch. That's what the point of this was. This was a great update. It was a good update. Well, great. This is a good update. It gave us literally what we wanted. It met our needs. But did it satisfy us? Um, I don't think so. I don't think quite it quite satisfy us. It gave us just enough to ha let us have some more fun with the game for a, lo for a longer period of time because we had it for almost six months. But we're going to need some DLC soon. We're going to need some more content soon because it's going to quickly fade again. Um, I'm not feeling myself fade that much yet because I am trying to take my time and not finish it all the way. So I have more stuff to do. But I could already tell that when I unlock all these suits and unlock all these gadgets and stuff, it's just going to be, you know, another repeat and rinse and repeat of just trying to find the fun, which, again, the game is just generally fun. I mean, when you get on it and swing around, it's just fun to do, which is why I spend most of my time on it. But again, it it could be useful to do more things. So with all that being said, uh, New Game Plus, it's a good update, but it could have been way better. And I feel like it still was a letdown in terms of how great this game was. This great. This game was nothing short of like a masterpiece like in my opinion you can say what you want but it was great it wasn't it wasn't like again perfect like i said eight out of ten again it's still masterpiece to me i don't know how you guys would rate your ratings but nothing is perfect and i feel like a masterpiece doesn't necessarily mean it's perfect it just means that it's monumental and that it literally is the top tier superhero game of all time it's like literally like most like, come on like i mean no what else to say about it it's, it's a great game and it's a great series of games as well and so i really agree 
uh, with the fact that this game should be ha getting more love, but it should be getting more content as well. It should be getting way more content. New Game Plus was long overdue. I know they had the hack and stuff like that, but I'm talking about before that. It should have been done before that. Before all that stuff happened, it should have been done. But that's my little tidbit on it. Hope you guys leave a like on this video. Subscribe if you are new. We're getting on some more Spider-Man 2 content. I've definitely got uh, more New Game Plus content planned with that. Peace.